Hey, what is up guys? I hope you're all having an amazing day. As usual, welcome back to the channel guys. Today, we're doing something that I've been wanting to do to the Del Sol for a while now. I've been about it, everything like that. Um, I told you guys in a previous video that I was going to wait until the next weekend from when that video was, whenever that was. Um, well, it is next weekend. So, guys, we're going to be throwing coilovers on the Del Sol. Now, guys, I didn't buy some expensive coilovers or anything like that. I'm actually going to be using the coilovers that are on the Integra. They are uh, True Heart, like Street Plus coilovers. They're just regular old like budget coilovers uh, they're pretty cheap entry level so i think it'll work for the del sol for now if i want to go nicer suspension on that car than i can in the future but the integra it's going to be getting some nice suspension hopefully bc's if i have the money for that um when the time comes but we're not focusing on the integra today guys we're focusing on the del sol so I guess without further ado, I'm going to go ahead and jack up both cars. Uh, I think I'm going to do fronts and then rears, so it'll be pretty easy. I'm going to break down a couple of things while I go. If you don't know how to install coilovers, it's pretty simple, and there's a whole lot more tutorials on YouTube if you want that. This isn't going to be a tutorial video, we're just throwing them on. So I guess let's get started guys. Alrighty, so pretty simple. Got both of the cars up. Just got to take the wheels off. Then we can uh, start getting into the suspension part of this. So, let's go. Alright guys, with the wheels off of both cars, we can go ahead and get into getting these coilovers out. Alright guys, got one coilover out. Let's do the other one. All right guys, so we got both coilovers removed. Now to remove the stock suspension from the Del Sol, transfer it on over to the Integra. All right guys, so we have all of the fronts off of the car. Before we start mounting these uh, coilovers on the Del Sol, we're gonna clean all of these up. I have some degreaser right there. So we're gonna clean them up, rinse them off, and then go ahead and throw them on the car. All right guys, so before we go ahead and throw these on the car, we're going to go ahead and adjust the height. It's always best to adjust the height on your coilovers while they're off the car. You can really get a good look at how they're positioned. And it's just a whole lot easier to turn those little like uh, screws. So we're going to go ahead and adjust the height. I don't think I'm going to completely slam it yet. But I am going to get it pretty low. Alright guys, we got the fronts on. And holy crap, already you can tell. This thing is going to be pretty, pretty low. I tried to not make it this low. Maybe I should have uh, unscrewed the coilovers a little bit more. But I don't know. I think we're just going to see how it rides. And if it at least rides okay, it'll be fine. But we're going to be living the low life. Alright guys, so with the fronts on, we're going to go ahead and put the wheels and all that back on the Integra, put the uh, the front down, and lift the rear up. Alright guys, so we got the rears off of the Integra right there. Going to go ahead and get these cleaned up real quick. Get the height adjusted, and then we'll pull the stock ones off of the Del Sol. Alright guys, real quick, I had to go get the Pope, but before we start taking the rears off, Look at that wheel gap. Of course, the Integra doesn't have a motor and it's on 16s, but even with the uh, suspension settled, this car, like, holy, holy shit. That's just a lot of wheel gap. But yeah, we're going to go and take off the rears, start getting ready to put them on the Del Sol. You guys, so I just got the first rear one done and it was so difficult trying to get the stock one out of here just because um, it's a whole lot longer than a lowered coilover type thing. Uh, so you really got to work it. And I even had to take that uh, lower control arm out. And it was, uh, it gave me just enough clearance to drop the whole stock coilover. So I'm going to go and get the other side and continue. 
All right, guys, as you can see, I got that coil over on. All the bolts are back in. And I'm having a little bit of trouble with this coil over just because that last bolt, if you can see it right there on the bottom of the coil over, isn't wanting to go in. I did have to take both of the uh, LCA bolts out just to let it drop. But hopefully I can get this last bolt in soon. Gonna keep on trying. Guys, got the coil overs on, getting the wheels on. About to get the front wheels on so that we can finally lower the car. I'm sure you can already tell, look at the rears. Already almost tucking and it's in the air. So yeah, without further ado guys, so let's go ahead and get this car on the ground. All right guys, wow. I am very, very surprised at how low the Del Sol is sitting right now. But um, yeah, this thing is super, yeah, it's pretty low. I mean, if I wanted to keep it on these stock wheels, then I'd throw some spacers on it. And it is gonna stay on the Fat Fives for a while just because I, I don't really have any other wheels. And I've really been uh, keeping my eye open for a set of wheels that I'm really gonna like. Yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm not really in the market for any wheels right now, but that's besides the point. So, car looks really good. I did forget one thing. I need to pull the fender liners out of the uh, the, the fender wells in the front. If I don't do that, then there's there's gonna be no point. Yeah, the wheel is touching the fender liner. That's pretty fucking low. So I'm gonna go and lift the uh, the front back up real quick. Just pull out the fender liner. No big deal, something super easy. So I'm gonna go and get that done. All right, guys, it looks like we're about finished. Got the center caps on, got all the, uh, the lugs tightened up and all that. The car is so freaking dirty right now though. Like I, I really need to take it for a wash. If I, if I wasn't scared of it raining, which you might not be able to tell, uh, but it's been like sprinkling and being really weird all day. So, but I think I'm still gonna wash it just because, I mean, Jesus Christ, it's dirty. But yeah, I'm rambling. Anyways guys, uh, I guess I'm gonna go ahead and lock up the house and we'll take her for a quick ride. Uh, my buddy actually wants me to go over to his house to help him roll his fenders. So I guess I'll go ahead and head over there. So I so. think I'm going to go ahead and end the video off here. I just got back home. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Just throwing the coilovers onto the car. Getting it super low, I guess. Anyways, guys, I'm rambling. Hope you all have an amazing day. If you guys enjoyed this video, please drop a like comment, subscribe, all that. Thank you guys very much for watching. I'm going to go and get out of here. Peace out. Must one person's triumph be another's humiliation? Of course.